We're all familiar with the saying, what goes around comes around. Karma does end up catching up in most cases, and it's usually the same in the world of fighting. In today's video, we'll take a look at some of the most satisfying instant karma moments in the boxing ring. In this next clip, this tattooed fighter puts on an arrogant display so intense that it makes you think he's about to crush the fight. Well, expect the unexpected because turns out he's all bark and no bite. Watch as the other fighter easily dominates him in just a few seconds, delivering well-deserved shit. The fighter in black gloves also thought he was being the king of the ring before the start of the match. In a few seconds, he was put into reality with a high kick so powerful that he landed on the ground right after. I guess that's karma talk. Here's a clip showing what might be one of the fastest knockouts that's ever occurred in a fight. After touching gloves, the one in black immediately landed a punch at his opponent, which is a cheap shot of trying to take advantage of his opponent's vulnerability. While well, his opponent knew exactly how to teach him a lesson, watch as he gets knocked out just as quickly. Here's another clip showing just how fast karma works for fighters. Without many words, you can already tell who's the arrogant fighter here, doing silly moves while smiling the whole time to taunt the opponent. Watch him get a taste of his own medicine as the opponent kicks him at the perfect spot at the perfect time, when he least expects it. Kudos to the other fighter for taking his time and being so accurate on his kick. There's a reason why dancing and combat sports are kept separate. This guy should have known before he even dared to throw in some dance moves. He got so smug with the dancing that he forgot how easily his opponent could attack him. Like an eagle waiting for his prey, the other fighter took his chance to strike back. The next video is one of boxing's most controversial knockouts. This was a fight between Floyd Mayweather and Victor Ortiz. Oddly enough, the controversy didn't start with Mayweather. Ortiz was actually the main culprit who started playing dirty by doing a headbutt. The referee cleared the air, but Mayweather isn't one to take a headbutt lightly. Watch as Mayweather takes his revenge. Here's another moment of instant karma. This time, it's in the world of jiu-jitsu. Take a look at how the younger fighter managed to break free and turn things around to victory. This only goes to show that while you may have the upper hand at one moment, the next moments are often unpredictable. Showboating among fighters is pretty normal. The general rule is to just don't overdo it. This guy did the exact opposite and paid the price for being too over the top. While he was throwing several decent punches, his opponent had a few tricks up his sleeve. In an instant, he got thrown to the ground, losing the fight. If you're going to be cocky toward your opponent while in the ring, you better make sure you show up to fight. This guy doesn't seem to get it as he taunts his opponent only to fuel the other's anger, enough to cost him the match. In this next clip, we see the fighter with colored hair trying to challenge his opponent to throw more punches. This proved to be a mistake as the opponent did exactly what he wanted. In the end, he got knocked out pretty badly in one of the most embarrassing ways possible. He got hit so badly that he needed a lot of medical help to recover. Here's another fighter taunting his opponent confidently. Well, Karma is about to teach him an important lesson. Never challenge your opponent to attack you because you might just end up losing it all. With his body and obvious strength, he could have won the fight easily, but he let his guard down, throwing away an easy win. Some of these fighters just never learn their lesson about fake glove touching. Watch as Karma hits this guy in an instant. He was going for the gloves and quickly went into full attack mode. While he did manage to trip his opponent first, he failed to secure the win as he ended up losing in the end. If it isn't clear enough, folks, no to fake glove touching. The guy in white shorts was supposed to be dominating the match until his opponent started to fight back with more power than ever. Just as he raised his arm, the opponent quickly launched a few more punches. This is exactly why you should never let your guard down in a match. One minute you're leading the scoreboard, the next you might be on the ground already. So that's all for today's episode, folks. If you enjoyed watching, leave a like and share it with your friends. You can also comment and let us know what you'd like to see from this channel in the future. Also, subscribe to Trend Loops if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.